Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy, back with our next crazy camp, and this week we're checking out Mystic Storm's build, and she built a giant Pokemon, but not just any Pokemon, she built a Snorlax, which, honestly, pretty darn cool choice, I can easily identify with a Snorlax, especially early in the morning when I'm trapped at work, it's like Snorlax is my spirit animal. Ah, what I do to get more sleep. Continuing on. So over here, we got the robot with all the steins and stuff. And the path actually continues over here. But we're actually going to backtrack later and come out that way. So, they're on the feet of the Snorlax. I like the idea of turning those into little stages, but I really love the use of defense items to create claws. It looks really good. But now let's make our way around and we'll go through the armpit to get to the inside. It sounds kind of weird. We're going to go through the armpit. You know what? Don't think about it too much. Over here we got the little frog staring at the cardinal. I kind of get the feeling that he wants to eat it, but maybe that's just me. I mean, his tongue was hanging out and everything. Pretty sure he wanted to eat the Cardinal. So, now that we're to the inside, it's a little dark in here. But, still pretty darn cool. In this next little section, little store set up. Got the new ally in here, hanging out. Causing all sorts of trouble. Now, there's quite a few little merge tricks here and there that are pretty interesting. Of course, you got the spot under the register where there's some Nuka-Cola bottles and the flipped around counter. Pretty darn cool spot, but one thing that really caught my eye is right up here where it says lunchbox. And by offsetting the letters, it actually looks... It looks right. It looks like that's how it should be. It looked good. Now we'll continue over to the next little section where you got the little train set set up. Except completely blocked in, giving it its own little unique feel. Now, if you're wondering, well, what was behind us during all of this? Let me spin around for you. Of course, you got the really nice Unstoppables uh, wallpaper. For some reason, my mind went blank for half a second, and I was like, uh-oh, I gotta catch back up. Over here, this display case, this is a really nice use of this display case, getting everything merged in there properly. That is one of my favorite display cases, but it can be a pain sometimes to work with. Now let's make our way back out. And this is the area I said that we would backtrack through later. Quick side note. I've said it once. I'll say it again. Remember to close doors, people. If you open it, close it. It's the least you could do. Actually, technically, the least you could do is just leave it wide open. But don't do that. Please. So, right over here, we got a little shack. And of course, you got the Red Rocket Collectron, which, honestly, still seems kind of weird when I see him walking around, because he just walks so darn slow, but he's so friggin' cool at the same time. So inside the little shack here, you got your spot to change out your perk loadout. You can do a little bit of crafting, all that good stuff. Also, slightly dark in here as well. Working our way around. We got the Mr. Fuzzy Tinker workbench, which is cool, but man, it it's just creepy. I don't know why, but it, again, it is the cool kind of creepy. So I think there's only one more thing to really point out, and I'll get to it here in a minute. It's going to be up here at this little race car bed. Because what she's done is she's got... Graham pulling the flower cart. And I, I don't think I've seen anybody else do that before, so that's a neat use of camp items. 
But I think that's going to wrap up the tour of her camp. Huge thank you to Mystic Storm for letting me share this with all of you. Pretty darn cool getting to check out a Pokemon build. Now, if you've got a crazy camp that you want to share, all you got to do, hop down in the comments, give me your gamer tag, brief description of your camp. I will try to get to it when I can. Hope you've enjoyed this. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.